Hello. Oh boy. Oh, there it goes. All right. I was like, why isn't the game capturing? I was like, we can't have another stream start with technical issues, but it's fine. I mean, there always will be at least one, right? <sighs> I am having a very good day, and it, it feels long overdue, so I'm really leaning, leaning into my good mood, which is really nice. Um, I've got, got some cats with me. Got Ellie up here in the window. We got Harvey over in the in the tree over there. But yeah, I um sorry I'm gonna try to keep my the cord from getting on my sweater here because the zipper. But um it's crazy how something as basic as healthcare can like make your day. Um having a new insurance through my new job, I was able to go and get an annual physical, which I haven't done since before the pandemic, when I was probably due for one back then. And just knowing that I could go get my physical and not get a $500 uh, bill was like really empowering, I think. Um, the last time I went to the doctor, they had to run a couple of tests and they didn't mention that, uh, it wasn't covered under my insurance. And I literally got like a $600 bill for routine care. It was absolutely ludicrous. And like, after arguing with like the insurance company and the doctor's office and how they bill it and like all this stuff, I got it down to like $450. Like <laughs> it was, it was not a good day. Um, and so just like going in today and knowing that like I'm only going to be responsible for my copay, like maybe a little bit for these other whatever else they're doing, but like feels good, feels good. I could be wrong. In in like three weeks, I might get another huge bill, but <laughs> I'm going to remain optimistic that that's not happening. Um, Allie, how are you doing? I know we've been chatting all day, but hey, Loof, welcome in. We're chatting about the healthcare system and how much it sucks. Uh, but how I was able to go and get my routine physical today and how that, that felt really nice. As someone who works for a medical insurance, good job uh, for, for talking them down and crying on the phone. <laughs> Just like, oh, that, that person felt so bad. Like they could tell that I was like starting to crack and like their, their tone got lower and they were like, listen, listen, I know... I know it's really uh, challenging right now, and we're gonna do everything that we can. Like they totally changed their tone once I was just like, <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> um, I'm sure they get that a lot. I'm, I'm sure they do. Um, but I don't know if you make enough phone calls, they they'll just take like a courtesy hundred dollars off of that thousand dollar bill. But, we're not here to talk about medical insurance and all that garbage. We're here to play games and pet cats. Uh, Luf, I don't know if you saw, I'm like right in the way of the cat. Oh, you know what? It's because I turned my monitor. I like adjusted my monitor the other day. Just wanna place myself, there we go. You can see me and the cat. This is like her favorite thing. She just, we want to talk about whatever you want. Aw, thanks Allie. Um, there's a squirrel on the roof and she's like, she's into it. All right, let's, let's load this up while we're chatting. Oh man, last night I was having the weirdest dreams. I had a dream about the zombie apocalypse and that I was like running through a hotel that was zombie infested with a couple of people. And I think it was Harvey actually was, was following our little group. And then at one point I like looked over and Harvey was there, but he wasn't coming anymore. And he was like, I'm going to go my own way. And his little kitty, kitty look, 
was like, you guys are great, but I'll do better on my own. And he left and I woke up and I was just like so upset. <laughs> I was like, Harvey, why? You're safer with us. And he was like, that is not true. You guys are lunatics. <laughs> it's been a weird day, you guys. You can tell I'm in a good mood, though. I have a lot more energy than I normally do. I also had an extra cup of coffee. That might do it. All right. Here we go. I don't think we need to go back. I keep, like, wondering if I need to go back to that area at any point, but I, I don't think that I do. And now I have to think about what is on the docket today. Like, where are the areas that I need to check out that I haven't been to yet? Where do I still have things that need doing? So, you know what? Let's suit up. And let's take a look at the ship log, because a lot of this I've been, like, glancing at, but I haven't actually been, like, reading through very much of it. I've read some of it. Every memory recorded by the Nomai statue is transmitted to a corresponding storage unit within Ash Twin. There's so much to do in this game, it's crazy. Yeah, it's weird. I was, like, getting the impression that I'm, like, getting close to whatever the end of this is, but I don't think that's true. This island must be where Nomai created statues, like the one in our observatory. Yep, so we've been here. This... There's more to explore here. There's more to explore everywhere. I also double checked my settings to make sure that time doesn't move while I'm reading. So that's nice. I'm, I'm not gonna read all, all of this stuff aloud because it's kind of just recap, but um, let's see. The quantum moon. We know a lot about the quantum moon, but not where it is. I know it changes its location based on where we see it. You thought the same thing often, and then boom, something new, and you were like, oh, hello. Yeah, I, I get that impression from this game a lot, which is very cool. It's it's funny when someone asks me, when I recommend this game, they're like, oh, can you describe it to me? And I'm like, it's really difficult. It's really tough to describe this game because any kind of like hint to what it's about and how it works feels like such a spoiler to the to the game. It feels like a disservice. Oh, hey, Ellie. Hi. Oh, she go went down. She'll come back. All right. Well, let's let's take a look at the map actually. Map mode. Hollow's lantern. Haven't even seen that yet. Dark bramble. I feel like we've been to that. A good game to go in almost blind. Yeah, I completely agree. You know where I want to go is I want to go to the this, this sun station. I, I just want to check that out. I am just curious. And I know that that's somewhere that we kind of have to go towards the start of this. Because I've just been so curious about it. And I was kind of like putting some stuff off a little bit. Because I didn't want to like go and see like everything on the horizon during the... Uh, we went there. Yeah, I remember that. Feels like it's sucking me in a little bit. Also, let me know. Oh, geez. All right. Well, 
I got too close. I flew too close to the sun. I was Icarus. That's fine. We'll try it. We'll try again. <laughs> I didn't think I was going that fast. I thought I had matched the uh, velocity. Yeah, I'm bad at this game. <laughs> that was the warm-up space travel. I just love the idea that, that like, these villagers um, just wake up. Or, like, they're looking up and they're like, Oh, they're doing their first uh, their first launch into space. We're so worried about them. And they just plummet straight into the sun. And they're like, Welp, that's too bad. Alright. I already know what I'm doing. Someone mentioned the, uh, the, uh, um, autopilot at one point. Alright. I just have to make sure I don't, like, accidentally, uh... I don't even know how I'm going to land on this. This is crazy. Oh, I just realized that because the sun is going to be really slowly growing, it doesn't really matter if I match the velocity. Hey, orc. Oh god, please don't. Uh, I want to land on you so bad. Uh, it's, I'm going to crash again. Yep, yep. Pulls me in. Maybe I can't land on that yet. I feel like I must be able to, but I have no idea how. The autopilot is tricky at best. It's, yeah, I kind of figure that. That's there, that was my guess. I'm sure it works, but we'll see. What was I saying a minute ago? Oh yeah, I adjusted the audio levels a little bit because I felt like, uh, well, on OBS it said that I was too loud, but the balance was okay. So I just turned both down a little bit, and I didn't do a test because I'm lazy. And it doesn't matter anyways, because anytime I do a test, it's not right. <laughs> How are you doing today, Orc? I'm gonna try this one more time. I really want to try to land on that thing, and I, I don't know if it's possible, but I want to. Almost your vacation. Hell yeah. I think it's so funny that, like, everybody's taking vacation next week. Yeah, look at that. It's just pulling me in. I'm just, like, suddenly going faster. Oh no, oh no, don't crush me. I don't even know if I can select that. Man, alright, away we go. Nope, nope, not gonna make it. Not, not making it. Alright, I'll do something else. <laughs> I don't know how to do that. You get close enough. Do you just have to like dive bomb it and hope you land on the thing? Like that doesn't seem right either. More thigh time. <laughs> that was so funny. Mark was so confused though. When you brought it up in his chat, he's like, I don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> Alright. Well, what's the saying? Like, if the third time doesn't work out, you give up, right? That sounds right. Okay. So let's take a look at this really quick. 
man, I know that I I know that it's possible to land on this. By the rules of this game, it's possible. I just don't know if I can do it. Um, let's go back to Giant's Deep. Ooh, maybe even Giant's Deep's Moon. Haven't seen that yet because that's new. Allie comments on uh, Cammy's thighs and then Garlic joins later. Yeah, it's so good. Hmm, I can't like match velocity with this. I can lock onto it, but... definitely went past it. Maybe I should just do this to, uh... Here. You take over. For a moment. Was I wrong that there's not a moon here? Or was that something else that I saw? Maybe there isn't. Oh, jeez. I didn't realize they're still going. Oh, well. This is all fine. Everything's fine. Hey, Ed. Is Ed okay? Or do you prefer Edward? Coming in for about a half hour before you go to bed? Awesome. Well, thanks for stopping in. Ed is fine? Cool. I, um, so far, all you've missed is I flew into the sun about four times, three or four times, because I was trying to land on the little platform, and, uh, didn't, didn't quite work out. Let's see. Not a good idea. I know it's possible. I know I can do it eventually, just not today. But I want to get on that sun platform. Alright, is this the... Ah! Oh, that's fine. Everything's fine. Oh, you guys, I'm the best pilot ever. Okay. Alright. What'd I break? Can I even get to it from down here? Probably not. It'll be fine. Just leave it. Aha. So it said there was more to explore on this island. Oh, probably this. But I can't go in there. him again now that I now that I know some things. I remember that was a specific prompt. Never get bored of the rain. I found something. Uh, I reached the inside of the statue island. So the Nomai created those head statues to record memories, huh? Uh, yeah, I could see the Nomai doing that. Not sure what for, but it seems like their sort of thing. Do you think the statues are recording our memories then? Because I remember that that one on the beach looked funny at me. Uh, that must uh, that must be my memory friend. Hello again, again. Uh, 
Where should I explore? Oh, that's right. A bright flash in the sky at the start of every loop. Okay. So that's something I'll just have to look for at the end of this loop. Yep, we've been to Statue Island. Uh, I was on the beach when the whole glowy business happened, by the way. Nice beach for that sort of thing. Yep, we've done, we've done all that. Was there anything else under... Oh, no, just... Uh, never mind. I feel like we have more to talk to him about than that. Um... And I don't know how to uh, navigate that yet. There must be a way. But I don't know what it is. I mostly just assume that I kind of have to look for whichever direction um, it's coming from. And then just like, oh, oops, that's fine. Like, is it just this? Because if it's just this, that's not important. But there must be something. Yeah, so that's just this tunnel. That's so weird for it to be there. Makes me think there has to be a reason for it. Let's try going under the island. Ship, I apologize in advance for the hell that I put you through. see through the camera pics. Yeah. Ooh, what? That's cool. What's that? Doesn't look like I can really go under that island. Oh, is this his, uh... This is his, uh, ship. Can I, like, what? If I get out of my ship right now, am I, like, screwed? You know what? We're gonna find out. As I do have to repair it, anyways. Destined to float forever, yeah. Hold to repair. Oh, come on. There we go. That's probably all I'm gonna bother to repair. Because it's just a little bit harder to navigate than I thought. That's my ship. I thought I'd be able to do something with that, but I guess not. Oh. My poor ship has been through so much. Alright. Can I go down? I guess not. That is the deepest I can go. Ooh, what if- is there something in the center of the storm? Because that would be cool. Oh, 
would like to go into the eye of the storm, please. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, that's so cool. All right. Ah! I just want to land. I just want to land. Ugh. Oh my god. This is so tough. Okay. Exit. Exit. There we go. Where is the healing? There we go. I'm just gonna leave it. I wanna look around. This is cool. I'm I'm just I don't know. I'm really glad that this game rewards like really like thinking and experimenting. I think that's really awesome. Maybe I need my ship still. take a look over here and then I'll grab my ship and try to navigate into some of that. Or maybe I'll just like wait until the uh, island goes up into the sky. If it does, I don't know if this particular one will do that because of its location. This is cool. This is cool! In the eye, you don't think so? Okay, thank you. Otherwise, I would just kind of wait around. Oh, well, it just sent me here anyways. I think that's that same. Oh, yep. Oh, no, this is a different room. Okay. I didn't mean to do that, but I'm glad I did it. Seek the Wandering Arch. From what you remember about this twister? Yeah. I assume I jump in there next, but I want to look at this tree. This tree's cool. Oh, what did the the art museum had something about this tree? Or a similar tree. Oh no, I don't remember what it was. Oh, that's so I'm just realizing how cool that is. Hold up. All right. Arch. Stop moving. I will stare at you until I fall through there. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. Ooh. Ah! <laughs> and I didn't- Ah! <laughs> That's so spooky. Why is that so spooky? Ah! I, I don't like that. <laughs> So spoopy. Um, observing a quantum object. Observing an image of a quantum object. These are the same. That's okay. Everything here moves when you look at it. So. Interesting. Okay. Mark dislikes, uh, Mark's dislike of the word, um, it makes you laugh, of spoopy. I 
I feel like this wouldn't work because I'm not actively looking at it. That's weird. How do I do this? It's like I can make it appear and, and disappear on this other spot, but not in front of me. And obviously I can't. There, and then there it goes. So, what if we go up and take a right? Because it won't be in that same spot by the time I get there, but maybe it'll be here in a little Arch, please. Oh, wait. Observing it and taking a picture of it are the same thing. Okay. Where is it? Yeah, yeah, mark his book club for games. Hey, that was cool. That was a fun little puzzle. Yeah, book club is where um, uh, a handful of us all met each other. Is there anything to read here before I dive into the thing? The arch and the crystal do not naturally meet. Interesting, okay. I see. Marks our origin story? Yeah, I mean, that's kind of true. disappeared while I was on it. What? Alright, alright, alright. Um, do I have to take a picture of... of this? Okay. you to go around. This doesn't feel like the way to solve the puzzle. I don't know why I take multiple pictures, just like expecting it to be different. Alright, so there's the arch. So if I recall it now, will it move? If I look at that and then look away and then look at it. Yeah, okay. That seems like rude for it to just like pop over to the other side. How dare. How dare this game. Uh, my phone buzzed, but it, I don't know why. Please, Gem. 
That is kind of interesting where you can like see the light come and go. How do I... get the arch? Actually, well maybe... If I can like see both? And then move on? doesn't quite work. Hold up. How did that work? I don't know how that worked. But also, as soon as I go up, I'm not going to be able to see it anymore. Um, is there... Has it been that long already? I need to get both of these. Ah! I'm like stressing out. I need more time. That's not the arch. Oh, I can turn this. I almost forgot. Uh, not yet. There we go. Um, but, um, thank you, Pyro. Uh, if I, if I do need help, I will let you know. I'm still in the try it until it works phase. Alright, cool, cool. This is the last one, but we made it harder. Just something you forgot when you played this. Yeah, if that comes up again, like where I don't know why that pre previous puzzle worked, uh, and I can't, um... Oh, this is such a bummer that like I'm here and it's resetting. we'll be able to get through most of that pretty quick on the next one. And I didn't go straight there last time, so. Oh, maybe we can go to, um, fi figure out what's going on in the sky right at the start. To that hint from, from what's his name. But how are you doing today, Pyro? Oh, maybe it is just the that that they're talking about. Oh, shit! I think I understand something. Super ready for the weekend? Oh, I feel that. Okay, alright. So I just saw this thing explode, right? And it fired a thing there. I think that that is what triggers the supernova. That is my suspicion right now. Don't tell me if I'm right, but that is my suspicion. Um, we must investigate. Yeah, but also like it, if it happens immediately, And how do you even track it? 
Like, what? This game! Alright, where's Giant Steve? You'd think I'd know where it is because it's always in the same goddamn spot, but nope. Alright. We'll let the autopilot do its thing for a minute. Unwinding and playing Animal Crossing? Nice! I recently got back into Animal Crossing a little bit. I've been playing it, like, during my, uh, oh, jeez. Um, during my lunch breaks at work. Slow. That was so spooky. That may have been my best landing ever. I'm proud of that one. That one felt good. Okay. Ship, don't go anywhere. Let's go do that whole thing again. Thank you, Allie. But yeah, I don't know. I go through, like, phases with Animal Crossing where I'll play it every day for, like, a month. And then I'll completely, like, forget about it for, like, a month. And then I come back and I'm like, oh, new items. I'm kind of at a point where if I really want my island to improve, I kind of have to overhaul it a little bit. But I also don't want to do that. I don't know. Uh, did I miss this before? Be welcomed in this place the tower shares with all who ask the knowledge needed to make his or her first quantum journey. Alright. Part of me thinks that if I go back into that starting room and just like fly up into it, that's like the final cham chamber. Quantum journey, yeah. Earlier I saw someone um, in another chat whose name was Quantum Walnut, and I love it. That's such a good name. Um, wait, hold on. Did I not read this before either? Uh, enter this place without friends, however... These are lessons. Um, these are lessons to learn for yourself. Uh, you've been at, at least logging on since launch, um, and you wanted to redo your entire island until uh, you leveled your husband's island, and no longer want to do that. <laughs> Fair. Okay. Yeah, it is expensive. Eventually. Um, bells just like aren't an issue like I engaged in the the bell stock market for a couple of weeks especially like with coworkers where we were all just like tracking um, who had like the best price where'd you go uh, and so I have like eight or nine million bells and I'm just like that's all I need forever And what I thought was kind of funny was seeing the different personality types with my coworkers, where like some people got 10 million bells and they were like, that's all I need. That's more than enough to ever do anything in this game. And then other people, like it didn't matter how many bells they had, they continued to push for more and more bells. Um, and I thought it was really interesting the different positions that those different personality types held, like more of the managers and higher tiered staff were the ones pushing for more and more bells and all of the like uh, entry level agents were like I got enough, it's fine <laughs> I was like there's a research paper somewhere there but I'm not going to write it also I should, I should really get in the habit of like 
pausing when I'm talking because of the time sensitivity of this game. Um, uh, okay, keep going. All right, so this one was super weird. And I haven't totally figured this one out yet, so maybe it's a good thing that I have to do it again. Don't you go anywhere. They can never be in the same place. So how did I do it before? I got rid of my camera. You got 10 million uh, from turnips, and that lasted you until redoing the island. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so I got that one there. Yeah, okay. Interesting. So they can't be in the same place naturally. However, if I have a picture of it, that doesn't matter. Feeding the pets sounds good. I almost looked away for a second, and that would have been done. I feel like I'm supposed to be doing something in these rooms, but I don't know what it is. Okay, so now we're back here. This is the last one, but we made it harder. Okay. D is that changing? Is the text changing? I feel like it is. Okay. Okay. Whoops. I kind of realized that was going to happen as soon as I started moving. That was close. Oh no, I did it again. Okay. At least I caught myself this time. Come on. I'd like to get two in a row. Come on. There we go. Just... Oh, and it disappeared, goddammit. And if they're both in the photo, that won't work. I saw it over there. There has to be a better way to get this. That ah, there it is. All right. Okay. Shit. Okay. Whew, 
Alright, alright, there we go, there we go. I don't feel like that should have been that hard, <laughs> but it was. Oh, there, fuck, yeah. Hell yeah. Alright, we'll need to go out. I'm sure in 10 minutes. That's how they do. Cool, okay. I'm ready for, like, this to turn into some weeping angel shit, and I just, like, actually have a heart attack. Congratulations! You've learned the rule of quantum imaging. Take this knowledge with you on the remainder of your quantum pilgrimage. Remember, the other quantum shards have other lessons to teach. Our curiosity goes with you on your journey. You walk in the footsteps of those who uh, came before you, and your path guides those who will follow later. Very interesting. Okay, so that's the exit. So I was kind of right. I could have just flown up here, but then I wouldn't have learned anything. <laughs> Weeping angels, your PTSD. Why? Yeah, I remember I played uh, SCP Containment Breach, and I didn't realize that. Uh, the whatever whatever creature was in that um, that game was very similar to the Weeping Angels, and it was just like it became artificially scary for me just because of the angels. Um, I still feel like I should like be doing something with this thing, but <laughs> that's never gonna get old. Is there anything to do down here with this thing? We saw this symbol before. I've seen it in the on the other planet on Hollow. You'll side eye a statue to this day. I know it was so scary, but then like I watched someone else play SCP and they were like spooked a couple of times, but they hadn't seen Doctor Who. And, uh, they were just, like, they figured out really quickly how to get around them and then just, like, didn't care. And would, like, occasionally be just be like, ah, but, but not, like, fear in their blood. Um, you know what, let's check in here because that was a lot of information that I thought would fill in more, but I guess not. Uh, this tower held knowledge to the no mind needed to make his first, his or her first quantum journey. Uh, no mind called this the role, the rule of quantum imaging. Remember, the other quantum shards have other lessons to teach. Interesting, but it's not telling you there's more to do here, which is kind of nice, unless. I know my uh, built a shrine on the quantum moon. Yeah, that's back to the moon. Okay. The moon that we know a lot about, but haven't seen yet. This was cool. That was very cool. I feel like the game really rewarded me there. Let's take a look at a map. been to Dark Bramble because of Bitter Hollow. Or no, maybe I've been to this thing. Maybe I haven't been to Dark Bramble. 
Probably don't have a lot of time left. Let's take a look at it. Man, I opened the window because I thought the cats were going to hang out and they're just not sad. I might close the window at some point. Oh, I'm coming in too fast. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Let's just not hit it. Maybe it's smaller than I thought. Maybe I haven't been here. This is cool. What do I know about Dark Bramble? I guess I'll park for a second. I feel like I'm getting like a drift. Like my, like I'm not moving it up and it's going up. I don't think that's my controller though. I know they've talked about Dark Bramble. Mm, well. It's fine. We don't need any of that uh, prerequisite information. Is this all just ice? What is this? Why is the music like that? So, were those, were all of those lights, those, uh, what are they called? You met my, you met your sleep paralysis demon. Yeah, no kidding. Oh my god. <sighs> That's interesting. Did it not fire the thing this time? Oh, I see it. Can I take a picture of it? Hold up. If I look away... Nope, it's still there. I 
can't. Oh, there we go. Why can't I fire my thing? As soon as I go up here, it's gonna be gone. You're clipping that? <laughs> you are more than welcome to, Allie. I think that's it. I'm gonna. Oh god, I just walked straight off the fucking platform. Oh, and I don't have a suit. Oh, well, I didn't take any fall damage. That's nice. Can I go through here, please? <laughs> why, why, why? <laughs> I'm gonna watch that later and fully embarrass myself. No. Game, why? I say again, why? <laughs> Am I stuck here? Did I just, like, trap myself? I go around. Okay. Whew. All right. I don't know if it's still there. Because I took too long fumbling around. Uh... And we're gonna go straight back there. I don't give a shit. I wanna know what's going on with those... I, I know what they're called, anglerfish. There we go. I just couldn't think of it. I even remember, they were like, anglerfish are from Dark Bramble. Now that I'm thinking about it. Alright. I also... I'm, I'm just looking for, uh... Oh, let's not go too close to the sun now. Um... I do want to check out whatever that thing was. Not... There we go. Um... You screamed because you went in full blast and they came out of nowhere? Yeah! Yeah, it's a good thing I didn't do that. I mean, they still got me, though. Like, I felt like I was being really cautious. You didn't go back for days. <laughs> so, like... I guess my question is, is everything a, uh, uh, are each of those, anglerfish, or is it just the ones in that inner circle? You know what, let's just go towards them and figure it out. This this is one of your two anxiety anxiety uh, planets. Yeah, I mean the music doesn't help. I mean that's what tipped me off too. Is that like, is like they wouldn't have music like this if it wasn't intentionally spooky AF. And then I saw those thorns and and I was like that. What is that? I just kind of want to really slowly approach one of these. And see if it is also an anglerfish. Ugh. I very much dislike the, the sound, the music here. I mean, it works. Oh, interesting. Okay. It's weird, the planet feels very small from the outside, but this uh, feels huge here. Maybe red is bad and I should like stay out of the red areas. Oh, this is so nerve wracking. Especially because you, like, can't get away. Like, I was pushing the, uh, the back 
jets, and it did not help. Alright, I'm feeling okay about my theory that only the red one is dangerous. So far. Oh, I hate this. It's so foggy, I can't even tell if I'm moving. Okay. Where am I going? I kind of want to see the anglerfish again. They were so cool looking. Terrifying. I feel like I'm in a loop. Let's try going to the left one this time. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, there it is. Oh, I dislike that sound. Ah! 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 Oh, oh shit! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> My theory was wrong! I thought it was safe because it wasn't red. Uh... <laughs> okay, but did you see me jump there? Because that was real. <laughs> Have some water. Thought I heard a cat. Not if if a cat comes up behind me and like taps my shoulder, I'll I'll cry. Okay, we're going to the right one. I feel like I'm barely moving and I'm going so quickly. Maybe it's because I keep holding the accelerator like as if I was running. Man, if it blinks out, does that mean it's not a, a thingy? Oh, I'm so, uh, I'm so nervous. be rules for this and I'm sure that there are but because I don't know what they are yet I'm very spooked about it hold up one is moving one is not let's go around this way But now 
I can't see the damn thing. And now I'm gonna get lost. Fuck. Oh, damn. Oh, there it is. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, oh, ah! Uh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, you don't. No, you don't. I found it first. You can't get me. I found it first. Go away, you stupid anglerfish. What could be in here? <laughs> Need to like breathe. <laughs> I hope you guys take pleasure in my fear. Is one of these moving? That was such a nice indicator last time. Yeah, I just gotta breathe. You right. Y'all, this is why I'm not great at horror games. Like, I've played Amnesia, and I've played small amounts of Outlast. Um, I dislike that. Um, and the problem that I ran into with both games was that, like, I could do the tasks, but I couldn't do them quickly. And so, like, oh, we have to go left or right, and I hate it. Um, what was the last one? The last one was right, let's go left. Go very slowly. Turn my headlights off. <laughs> Feel that? Yeah. Like, I, I enjoy playing horror games for like a minute on Halloween and stuff, and like that's fun. I'll probably do that come October on stream just just for the lulls, but I don't think I would Oh, that's that was weird. Ah! 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 Oh my god, oh my god, what did I press? What the fuck? <laughs> This is so scary. Oh, I'm so screwed. <laughs> ah, crap. Is this where I started? Is this the exit? Okay, alright. Oh god, my poor ship. I panicked and crashed and died. Alright. Slow down. System's damaged. I don't care. It's fine. Has been ten minutes yet. How am I supposed to do this again? Like, you have to take your time and be so slow and methodical. And then I know I'm going to have to do this again and, and be quick about it. Like, if I die, or if it just times out. Oh, shit. Man, I'm glad that I still have the planet selected. This place was rough for you. I can't imagine why. This is a breeze. Oh, god. What's... Th is that just the wall? Oh, my thruster is damaged, so I can't do anything. Hold on. Oh, God. Do I really have to get out? Uh... Uh... Okay. Please. 
is Mr. Fishies. Okay, now hold X to repair. Oh god. I wish I could velocity match with my ship. Is that good enough? Ship, will you not complain? Nope, because the thruster is still out. I'm way better at this than you. I doubt it. Because I don't feel like I'm very good at this. Oh, you floated away and got eaten? No, <laughs> Ellie! No. There's still time. There's still time for me to f fuck this up royally. to go into the center of this absolute madness. Uh, uh. At least my headlights are off this time. Such an idiot. <laughs> I should have checked that first. I don't even see any lights. It's gonna totally sneak up on me and I'm gonna cry. I'm like so hunched over, I need to like sit up and take some deep breaths. Okay. I'm so lost. Oh. There's a light. I'm pretty sure that that is not the light that we want, but I don't have another lead right now. Let's not break the ship. Oh. Uh. I kind of wish that I still had my, uh, speed, my barometer. Alright, that's definitely a fish, because it's moving. Oh, there's the second one. Which is which? Headlights off. They're both moving a little bit. That's unfortunate. This one we go. I'm like, I'm so disoriented that I don't know which one I already went to. And that freaks me out too. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. Okay, all right, cool. Oh, I love one light. One light is my favorite kind of light. Oh, nope. Never mind. Never mind. There are multiple lights. We're going to this one. Victory for now. <laughs> This gives me such Subnautica vibes of just like, we need to go deeper. Uh, I heard it make a noise, but I 
don't know if that's it. Oh yes, hell yeah, hell yeah. Is this an infinite loop? Like, what the hell? I'm starting to wonder if it's like always go to the one that's closest to the center. This is starting to just feel like an infinite loop. Oh, and we're running out of time. I guess we'll just run into the jaws of death. What happens if I just keep going? Is this an infinite loop? I think this is an infinite loop. Have I been putting myself through suffering for nothing? Uh, oh god. There must be something to learn here. Come on. Yeah, don't don't you dare. We're just gonna keep going until Loop, yes, infinite. Uh, Alright. Well, I'm gonna keep going for a minute. And hopefully I see something different by the time I respawn. Why are those lights still there? <laughs> we got a cat back. Cat says hello. Oh! There it went. Where did that go? That feels like it landed... The void looks back. Did that thing land here? I mean... I'm gonna I'm gonna go to my log in a second, but I just wanna see if I can. How are the wilds so far? Did you miss my cowardly like attempt to explore the anglerfish? Because oh my god. Is that it? That thing is moving. Clipped it. Yeah, there were two. There were two uh, spooks in particular. Aligning flight trajectory. Stage one. What? That's weird. It just went into uh, autopilot.
What am I matching trajectory to? Whatever this thing is? What are you? Oh, the sun. this thing. Stop, stop the autopilot. It keeps automatically engaging my autopilot. I'm getting really pissed about it. And now I'm gonna lose the thing. Fuck. I'm gonna crash into the sun because my autopilot was being this thing. Like, I see it. I was so close to it. And then it looked like I could highlight it and I couldn't. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Come back, come back. Uh, how do I match trajectory with it? Brr. This game is so hard to understand from casual viewing. Absolutely, I can see that. Um, if you want me to explain anything, let me know. bigger than I thought it was. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yes, yes. What the fuck are you? anything with it? Hey, Nob. How are you doing? I just found this thing. I don't know what this is. Alright, please don't fly away, ship. It's gonna fly away. Why wouldn't it? But this is more important. I wanna check this out. Can I go in here? You're great? That's awesome. I'm having a great day, too. Um, trying to uh, mark and have pay attention. Gotcha, gotcha. No worries. Yeah, I'm almost always multitasking when I'm watching streams. Um... I wish I could scan this or learn anything from this now that I'm here. Let's, you know what, let's just, uh, hang out with it for a couple of minutes, because my question, and let's check the map while I'm here. Oh man, where am I? Oh, I'm like really far out. 
My curiosity is if this is going to crash into the sun and cause the supernova. That's my question. So how are you guys doing? How's everybody doing? I, um, I'm in a great mood because I got my vaccine appointment. So next Tuesday is, uh, is going to be the day for me. Yeah, I'm really excited. Like, thank you. Um, I feel like I got really lucky because I just went to my PCP and they were they were scheduling them. Um, and going to the uh, going to the PCP was a really big deal for me because I've been kind of like avoiding going to the doctor for about a year because I didn't have I either didn't have health insurance or I had really poor health insurance. And now that I have like a half decent health insurance. Um, with my new job, I was like, oh, I can go and get a physical and it won't cost, like, $500. Uh, shot one? It's, yeah, shot one. Yours is in two weeks. Congratulations to you, too. And let's see, have we moved at all? Zoom out as far as we can. Oh my god, I'm so far away. That's wild. Gonna walk the pup and get ready to stream? Sounds good, Allie. Here, I'm gonna... You know, while we're just... Uh... I guess I probably do have to pause it to click off the game. But I'm going to give you a quick shout out. If you're not already, definitely go follow Allie. I've been working on Tomb Raider playthroughs, just hit affiliate, and we're really excited for her. And she's also awesome if you needed another reason. Was this a mistake? Should I not have followed this thing? This this must have significance. I know that. I know that it must. Not sure what to do here yet. Um, next is decoupling health insurance from your job so you have the freedom to do what you want. Uh, but that's a different stream. Gonna... Yeah, it's. Uh, I I would love for health insurance in the U.S. at least to not be locked to employers. I think that that puts too much. Um, uh, that, that too much responsibility on a company, right? A company that really most of the time doesn't have that much interest in your well-being. They, they're there to make money. Um, and like, sure, they don't want to train up new people. They don't want you to get sick. But if you are working for something like a temp agency, like I was, they they don't care about your well-being for for your day-to-day -day life um and that's a really hard place to be that's a really hard uh situation to find yourself in i man i feel like i'm wasting my time here but also like at this point going back is gonna take forever Well, at least we know it's not quantum, because it's still here. <laughs> yeah, the stars are pretty. Part of me wonders about some of these stars that look like they have stuff around them. Like, 
Is that stuff from our solar system? Space is astounding. This game makes me feel small as fuck. Like, I see some stuff in the corner there. There's that over there. Is that just the sun, I wonder? I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna leave this thing locked on, and I'm gonna... I'm gonna move off from it, and we'll just keep an eye out. Let's go back in this direction. I see two things that look like potential legit places. I could just be going the totally wrong direction. Let's at least... Oh my god, I'm just like so far away from anything. Yeah, oh okay, maybe that's just the background. That planety looking thing. Alright, so let's... Man, am I just like too far out to even see the sun? Am I totally lost? In... I don't want to unlink from that thing, so I want to see where it goes. I'm sorry, this is a boring part of the stream, where we just sort of wander, but I feel like this is necessary exploration. Alright, is there a way that I can even just determine which way I'm supposed to go? Picked a direction and we are going this direction. It's getting bigger. Maybe. Maybe it's just disappearing. Fuck. How did I lose the sun? Fly a bit on autopilot. We'll try to take you back. I think it'll just bring me back to this. Actually, it's not even letting me do autopilot. You were never able to catch the thing? Yeah, I got lucky, but like, I still don't know what its significance is. Lost in space forever. Lost in space. Na, 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 na. Any, uh, Aventasia fans in the chat? I'm so lost, what? <laughs> How did I lose? I never thought that I would lose the sun. I didn't consider that that was possible. Like, I feel like the sun would always be within bounds. Maybe this just goes infinite? <laughs> you and Luke are gonna colonize, uh, colonize Venus? I think Venus is, like, underexplored. Like, I get that it rains acid and stuff, but it looks cool. There's, like, one picture from Venus, and I think it's, like, the coolest shit. Like, the, the rover, or, like, the the camera landed and then melted, <laughs> and it was just gone. Alright, we are, we are, uh, we are lost, and I don't even know how to reset. Can my signal scope do anything? <laughs> no. There it goes. You know what, let's just send it and we'll just come back and check it. These are misleading, these like really bright stars. It makes me think that we're close to stuff and we're just not. could, like, try to die. Maybe.
Maybe my theory was wrong. Maybe it's not this thing. Because, like, I was thinking, like, maybe it does, like, one big loop and then, and then lands into it. Yeah. Oh, maybe I, like, don't even have the thing selected anymore. That would be a bummer, because now it's locking onto the scout, I think. Yeah, I think that thing is just gone. All right. Uh, let's... Oh, wait, no, there it is. Man, this scout is not very helpful. Oh, hey, Marcus. Welcome in. We're, we're exploring and it's, uh... It's not going how I expected it to, but you know what? Maybe I needed this moment of peace at the a after the sheer horror that I experienced a few minutes ago. I needed I needed a break. <laughs> this thing is so far away. I'm realizing. Okay, all right. This isn't gonna work. This is. All right. If I ram into my own ship, will I accidentally hurt myself enough and then be able to reset? Because I am so fucking lost. Looking at the sp yeah, I was looking at the speed as my distance also, and then it was like however many kilometers, and it was like every couple of seconds. Uh, hey, Kronar. Just saw the Discord message. How's it going? Learned something new. We went to the dark, whatever it was, and I scared the living shit out of me. Allie got a clip of it. There were, yeah, dark bramble, yeah. Um, and right now I'm lost. I was following this, like, probe, and now I'm, like, in the middle of nowhere. I'm, like, so far out that I, I can't actually find the sun. And whenever I find something on the horizon that looks like the sun, it's actually not. And it disappears as I move closer to it and I'm just completely lost. Cause I like don't wanna... Oh, that was kind of close. All right, actually, I guess it doesn't matter if I stay locked on to the probe anymore. Cause like, cause there's the probe, right? Um. Could burn through my fuel. Yeah, that's pretty much what I'm doing right now. Um, I guess we'll just do this shit. This makes me mad. But... <laughs> I never would have found it! How can the sun not be visible? <laughs> yeah, like, I realized that that was a quick option. But I just really wanted to see if that probe was going to crash into the sun, and then it just didn't. Um, if you need to reset the sun, you can take off your suit inside the ship. Oh, and then just go out. I, I see. Yeah, you know what? You know, fuck this. Hold, hold on. I'm doing what you suggested. Oh my god. <laughs> Christ. Well, we took the ten, ten minutes anyways, but however long. Yeah, that's that's good to know that I can reset the run like that. I didn't think about that, but man, those choking sounds. Okay, yeah, so we went to Dark Bramble and explored around, died pretty quickly to the anglerfish. Um, and then I went back because I was like, this is cool though. And so I kept diving in, right, and going further and further trying to get to the center, and then it was just repeating. And so I'm like, 
Yeah, that's the thing that we were following. I pointed at my screen, you can't tell, but I... Yeah. Um... And, like, I know that there must be something else in Dark Bramble for t for me to go back there. I'm sure that there's a, a reason for it. But I don't know what it is yet. And, uh... I'm, I'm, like, upset to go through all of that again. I'm also gonna close the window. Give me one moment. It will reveal itself in time. Yeah, I'm sure it will. I'm just like... I'm a little bit salty that I went through all of that and, like, didn't get any pieces of information except for just, like, what I saw, I guess. I don't know. What else have we done? We went back to... Uh... Where do we go? Wasn't Timber Hearth, Giant Steep. We went back to Giant Steep and we found the tower. The vessel. Yeah, I went through the tower and I learned about quantum travel. The vessel. The hell. Apollo's lantern. Power of quantum knowledge. We went there. You know what? I'm gonna close my door too. Sorry, I'm getting up so much. Okay. We still haven't really gone to the uh, the second twin. We only went to the one on the last stream. That would be a cool place to check out now. I'm like, Ugh, but I kind of want to go back to Dark Bramble and like figure it out. You know what? God, whatever. We're gonna. We're gonna do it. I'm gonna regret it immensely. I already regret it. Hey, Kim. We're not supposed to be staring into the sun. <laughs> I flew into the sun a couple of times at the start of the stream because I wanted to, uh, um, I wanted to go to a platform that I saw and just like three times just plummeted straight into it. Oh, I hate this so much. I hate this so much. Alright, I have a theory, and I'm just gonna roll with it. I think that I just want to dive into the center. I swear to god if I die. I'm gonna freak out. Oh, 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 nope, I was wrong, I was wrong, it's not the center. It's not the center, okay. Rip. <laughs> 
At least I, I knew it was coming this time. Yeah, those are those angler fish that I was talking about. Is this demon souls? Basically. You didn't know it was coming this time. I'm sorry, Luke. I hope you didn't get too bad of a fright. If I go with confidence, I won't be scared. Luffy doesn't get scared. Is this gonna- is the autopilot just gonna take me straight into the sun? wake up uh yeah yeah you wake up run to the ship and he just watches as you set sail uh set sail straight for the bramble yeah i was saying that earlier when i like crashed into the sun right away i was like man these people must be like looking up and they're like oh maiden voyage and then fall directly into the sun bumping into the wall. Alright, here's the center. spooky. So I went to the red one first last time, and I got eaten. I'm wondering, like maybe I have to go back to the red one and I just have to be more cautious? It's hard to tell if they're moving. Uh, fun fact, in earlier versions of the game, you could actually find the exterior of the Bramble if you went uh, down from the sun far enough. Interesting. Nope, 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 nope. Don't need that. Let's go to the other one. The other white one. A friend. Give him a hug! I am a hugger. This game is so good at being spooky by just being so fucking mysterious. Nope, 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 nope! Friend? <laughs> that is... No! Damn it. Damn it. He hugged too hard. Second friend. All right, next I'm gonna go to the the red ones because I don't know. I made so much pro progress on that other that second attempt where I went to the center like at least fifteen times. So like, I want to know. 
which theory is correct. Like, I just kind of want to know which line of my thinking right now is correct. That's one thing that got you because you didn't know there were two in there. Well, on my first attempt, I got eaten by like six all at once. That was not fun. Slightly better at navigating here. Does it matter, like, which direction from the outside I come from? Like, these are all so many questions. So many questions. Fucking spooky. Okay. The last time it was this one to the left. Slow. Don't hit the wall. Oh, then it like disappears. There it is. You know what? Let's go to the red one this time. I have questions. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, there we go. Headlights are off. That will probably help. Please, sir. Just stay where you are. Oh, <laughs> that scared me. No, I you can't get me. I'm in a little hidden area. Neener, neener, neener. You can't get me. I'm like stuck here now. Oh. Uh, what if I just go past him? He's gonna kill me. I'm so fucking dead. What's at the red dot? Ooh, okay. Alright, different. Different. Alright, I think this is where I got to before. Yeah, this is where I went before. And I, like immediately died. No. Whoa. All right, I went back out. That was unexpected. Yeah, he's breathing on me. No kidding. I wonder, do I have to like I'm so What? What did I... What? Stop it! Stop it. Stop moving. Let's go fix the damn shit. Oh, stop moving around! You're gonna hurt yourself. The gravity is, is weird. Come on. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Down, up, 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 down, down, up, up, down, down. Hold. Down. Closer. Oh, 
Almost there. There we go. Whew! That was, that was tricky. Oh, god damn it! <laughs> oh, I'm so bad at this game. And it was the oxygen tank again, too. Alright. Let's see. Let's go this way. I don't like where those dots are located on that side. Let's see if it's the same on a different entrance. This looks the same, or very, very similar. Man, I am so uncertain. That's what's getting me right now, is just how uncertain I am about this planet. I don't know what anything means yet. I'm sure I'll figure it out. Oh, there's the center. Heading out for the night. Have a good night, Loof. Thank you for stopping in. I hope this mindfuck was, was entertaining for you. What time is it? even a different one to like go to this time. Back, 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 back. That is super weird. It's like, was there not another area that I was supposed to go to in this particular? I can't believe I got away from that thing. I'm like, everything is broken, but I'm still alive, which is kind of shocking. We got an entrance here. But there's no light. There's one light, and that is our friend. Oh, I'm so totally gonna get eaten. After this, uh, this cycle, I'm gonna go to a different planet. Oh no, I didn't want to go in. Um, and we're gonna do something different, because maybe I just need to think on this for a little bit. a lot of repairs. I'm sure it's operable. Alright. Now where the fuck 
am I? Why is there only one light? Hey, hey Nine, how are you doing? This game is freaking me out. Ugh, I hate this one light. I'm so fucking lost. Uh, do you mind a hint to half the answer for navigating this place safely? It's technically something I already found out. Um... If it's something I've already said, you can tell me I'm on the right track. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Um, yeah, I'd like I'd like to know what I was correct about, I think. Like, I, I want to figure this out, but I also don't want to continue wandering completely aimlessly. I might have to restart this area anyways, because I'm just, like, not finding anything, and I'm about to be eaten and eaten, but that's fine. Um, you're good, just one of those moments where the amount of dishes in your sink convinced you that you're not hungry. <laughs> uh, that's, that's a mood. I've got some dishes sitting in the sink right now that I'm going to have to go take care of when I'm done streaming. <gasps> Harvey? I just closed the door and now he wants in. Go let him in. He's so nervous today. Come here. Come on. Nope. In that case, you will say the anglerfish are blind. The other part is something you'll find out closer to the end. Okay. All right. Um, oh, I should have paused this. I hope that wasn't time taken away. Thank you. That was, that was a good hint. That was a good hint that didn't, like, give it away. I appreciate that a lot, because it's 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 so tough. There's it's a fine line, right? Yeah, because I I thought about the the flashlight, and I just like need to make sure that it's off. Kato, yeah. He's like, I think he he tried to come in, and then he didn't want to. Uh. uh He, like, didn't want to walk past me, and I think it's because I've been picking him up too much lately, and I need to... need to let him have his space. Where is it? Oh, is it just on the other side of the sun? Maybe? Oh, there it is. Am I tiny or is the anglerfish huge? It's a good question. Yeah, 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 that's... Usually I have, like... Usually I'm more flexible on, on hints. Like, hints are okay, spoilers are bad. But, like, for puzzles and stuff in games where, like, I'm really just playing the game to, um... Uh... Enjoy the story, right? And not, like, solving puzzles. Tell me why was a good example. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Match trajectory. All right. Heading in. Um, that one I, I didn't mind if chat helped with the puzzles. Because, like, those types of puzzles don't... Uh, they're not my primary reason for playing the game. Here, though, it's like your discovery is the whole fucking thing. Okay. 
given the scale here, you'd say pretty small. Yeah, it's hard. It's hard to say. Oh, maybe I just need to like not use my jets like at all. I I have my headlights off. Mr. Fish. Inertia, yeah. That's right. Oh, I hate that so much. Just see that fish. Slow and steady. This game is so spooky. They're somehow worse when they're still. I kind of agree. Um, like, when I went in, like, guns blazing, I was spooked, right? Um, when they caught me. But I also, like, was expecting something bad to happen and expect them to come at me and, like, when I'm running from them and you like kind of get a good look at them, it's it's not a big deal. But when they're still and then you get close enough and then they move, yeah. Yeah, the noise and the number of them, yeah. Oh, I hate that sound. Ah! Ah! Oh my god, what? Alright, that's not fair. That's not fair. <laughs> that's... Oh, that sucks. Did we bump him? I don't think so. That was so dirty. Oh. Alright, I'm gonna do a different planet for a minute. I'm gonna take a break from this. I don't want to frustrate myself on it. Like, my curiosity is still strong. But if I, uh... If I do it again right now and it doesn't go well, I'm gonna start to get frustrated. And I want to just think on it for a little bit. So let's go check out... Who knew anglerfish were so triggering? Yeah. Yeah, there's a, there's a lot to learn. Uh, that's exactly right. There's so much more that I haven't even looked at yet. So, um... I can absolutely take a break and then come back to it. I still really want to go to the surface of the, the sun... Slow down, slow down, slow down. Autopilot, what are you doing? I haven't been to the sand version of this yet. I think, yeah, I've been to the sun a lot, you're right. At least six times. Is everything on this planet still buried? Is that the catch here? Oh, nope, there's something, there's something. Slow down. Yeah, there we go, I needed this to turn around.
Oh yeah, it's just buried. All right, well, I know to come back here towards the end. What can I do in the meantime? We can go back and check out this because we started to look at it. Okay. Um, still a whole solar system to explore, exactly. Uh, do you start the game kind of stuck on that one planet for a while? So you, a little bit, you start on the home planet and um, you get your launch codes for how to leave the that planet. So you just like basically do a little tutorial area, which I thought was really clever. Whoa, ah! I should have expected that from Cactus, but for some reason I didn't. If I go down there, will I be able to get back up? That's the question. Ooh, there's something written over there. Oh yeah, look at it go! It's starting to reveal itself, alright. Oh, perfect. Yeah, okay, I've been there. Oh no, okay, rock. Rock, no flip. What have I done? Ah. Sunless city. High energy lab. I think we got in here before. I'm torn, like I want to go digging or like looking around, but I also don't want to miss the yeah, this other planet. Oh, I'd remember getting in the the lab. You know what we can do right now while we've got time? So we can take a look at our map. Where are the twins? Huh. I'm a little confused by the hanging city being attached to the anglerfish. Oh, I guess it had something mentioned about the anglerfish. And then there was the fossils. The Nomai city built into the walls of a huge underground cavern. The uh, city is divided vertically into four districts. That might be our next thing, is to dive back into that, into the sand planet, that second twin. Oh, this is so cool. I can't believe I, I never even noticed this before. The 
question of where to park is funny. really funny to park all the way up on that platform and then never be able to get back up to it. I saw a different little platform somewhere over here. It's so hard to see over the horizon of this planet. Ooh. Oh, here it is. What is this? Oh, this is so cool. Oh my god, I'm like... As the planet gets smaller, it loses gravity, I bet. You know, this actually does ring a bell. Maybe I have been here. Maybe not. This is cool looking. This is very cool looking. up here. What goes up? Ooh, okay. Alright. Oops. I will take that. I haven't seen anywhere to put it yet. Ooh, that's cool. Let's go down here. Hell yeah. Oh! No, 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 no! Oh no, this is taking me to the other planet. Oh fuck. Oh no. Oh no. What did I hit? Oh, I landed on the other planet. God damn it. <laughs> I just fly over? If this works, I'm gonna laugh. Down, 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 down. Up, down, up. Yeah! Yeah! That takes me up to the ship. If I had parked there. That's nice of them. Can I go back to that other building? Will I be completely lost? I mean, the planet's only getting smaller, right? This looks like it. Oh, I'm like running out of fuel. I need to stop doing that when I don't need to. Oh my god, that's so cool. Alright, let's get out of here. Stay back while it goes by. Three minutes of oxygen remaining. Okay.
Oh, hell yeah, somewhere to put the scroll. Uh, PYE, friends visiting from Hanging City. We are planning the Ash Twin Project at High Energy Lab on Ember Twin, Ember Twin's equator. I became lost on Ember Twin, my gratitude that Brahmi found me, but the High Energy Lab is the building with the large solar panels. I'm surprised I didn't see it. I imagine our otherwise immensely clever Hanoi would lose his head if it weren't anatomically impossible. Alright. can't get into. So I guess I have to go around the other way. Oh no. That was a mistake. I just hope I can outrun this thing. I know I can't. Oh shit. But this also looks locked? This is new. Maybe it's not locked. Is that a... Hell yeah. Oh, some air! What a blessing. There's just another way through. our first delivery, Yarrow, one warp core, fresh from the Black Hole Forge. Root is installing this core's sibling on Brittle Hollow as I write this. My gratitude, Clary, with this, the Ash Twin project is underway. I confess I deep, I'm deeply curious about what you and Pokey found on the White Hole Station that started this project. Could I visit sometime and learn more? I recommend you do. The Whitehole Station is the model for the towers being built for Ash Twin Project. So a visit to the Southern Station would be doubly useful. I suppose more precisely, I would like to visit Whitehole Station with you, Clary. Yarrow, stop using this scroll wall to flirt with my sister. In, a, in romantic matters, her density rivals a neutron star. <laughs> and go... Meet her on the White Hole Station. I'd be happy to explain our findings. I wish I could wait here for you to arrive, but the forge and my unfinished work there is calling. I'll return with more materials soon. Okay. It doesn't matter how many, how much of this game I complete, I am always going to feel like I'm missing something. Alright, let's wait for this to pass. Just go down here for a second. That feeling 
does not leave for a while. Yeah. Yeah, like, I, I mean, I'm, I'm grateful for it, right? Because this is so new to me, it's fascinating. Um... But yeah, I can just tell that it's going to be like a long time until I'm like feeling confident that I've found everything. I think that's why I really like that the game has uh, those indicators. Oh, there's still more down. I feel like I've been there. Probably. Let's go over this way. I don't know if this is gonna end up doing anything, but... I wonder where my ship is. I haven't seen it in a while. I kinda thought I would die by now. Is it up? Ship? Oh, it's just on the other side. do need some air soon. Although I might be like too deep in this crater. Did I just walk all the way around? Ship, please. Oh, there it is. Ship, I'm so proud of you. You hung out. You didn't... You didn't break. Okay. Kind of like expecting to find something under here, but I don't know if I will. Ooh, maybe it will. This might just be the the path up to where your ship should be parked. Let's find out. No. Oh, this is where I was like, where does this go down to? planet is very small now. Now it doesn't matter if I waste my fuel. Been here. Whitehole Station has info on those teleport pads. Yeah, I know that if I... Oh, are those teleport pads? Oh, they are, aren't they? Yeah, I know if I, like, stand on them and look up, it'll send me somewhere as long as I don't get swept up by the sand I guess that's a good question like where does this where do these go thanks for the gentle nudge oh no oh you know what I bet that one of these goes to that station on the sun oh I'm like too close to the edge. There we go.
gonna get some sleep. Sounds good. Have a great night, Nine. If this does go to the sun station, it's probably just too late. Oh, this might line up. Oh, it did it! Alright. Oh, what? Come on. What? How did it send me back? <laughs> Alright. That's fine. Oh, hell yeah, there's something in the center here now. Oh, slow down. Oh, don't die. Oh, god. Alright. Oh, this just goes up to the top. Yeah, this is so trippy. I don't know where I am. Except that I don't want to be here. We found it! We found the core! Alright, well... Not long now. This planet's cool, though. Alright, so we've got three of these teleports. We know that one of them goes to uh, one of them goes to the, the planet that's collapsing inward. Brittle hollow. Very interesting. Back it up. Let's watch it happen. That's so cool. That doesn't get old. It's very cool every time. Oh, that's cool. On the planet. Protect your eyes. All right. I think, I think this is a good place to call it for now. This has been a very interesting stream, so we saw the anglerfish. I don't feel like I made very much progress, like I don't feel like I've learned very much, but I saw a lot of things. So it's kind of like I, I have some good places to start the next time I play this, which will probably be Saturday, probably an earlier stream on Saturday. Uh, so I've got some plans in the evening, um, but uh, I'm, I'm eager to play this more. I'm like, I'm honestly feeling just like a smidge stumped right now. Like now I know that those teleporters are there and that if I, uh, I can like test where each one of them goes, um, figure out the anglerfish shit. I'm still I'm still mad about like being extra cautious and then that one anglerfish was just like I'm coming from behind. <laughs> but we found a couple keys to a fairly large amount of stuff. Yeah, that's how I feel right now. I agree 100%. Like I have information that I can use, but I haven't solved anything yet.
Um, but you know, that's how it goes. So that'll just make the next one even more exciting. Um, I am glad to have gotten the angler fish out of the way a little bit. I mean, I know I have to go back there, but I got the discovery of them out of the way. Um, but yeah, I'm feeling kind of hungry. Thank you so much, you guys, for hanging out. Thank you, Kim. Thank you. Thank you, Cronarch. Um, let's see who we can read. I appreciate your help as well. You were very good at offering suggestions that didn't spoil it for me. Yeah, see you later, Marcus. Let's see who's online. I always have to check on my phone before I can do the raid because the raid on the uh, Twitch doesn't show me everybody who I follow that's online. 